We're working hard to ensure a bright future for all of us, but we need your help too. We're facing some big challenges about how we manage water, so we've got some important choices to make. Historical scenes of grossly polluted rivers are a thing of the past. River water quality is the best it's been for a hundred years. Look at the river on your doorstep. Perfect, isn't it? Not quite. Although they look perfectly clean, our rivers still contain traces of potentially harmful chemicals from historic use and from the chemicals we use every day. We should be proud of how we have cleaned up our rivers, but there is still much more we can do to protect this precious resource. We need your help. We use chemicals in a huge number of different ways, some of which we would struggle to live without, like medicines. Chemicals can enter the water environment from sewers, industrial discharges and by runoff from lands and roads. Tiny amounts of chemicals get into the food chain from water. They gradually build up in the bodies of fish, which are then eaten by birds and animals. The higher up the chain you go, the more toxins accumulate and the bigger impacts they have. These modern-day impacts are more complex and subtle than those caused by the industrial pollution of the past. Water companies are able to remove some harmful chemicals from our wastewater, but our treatment systems were never designed to manage the vast array of chemicals we use now. Treating our wastewater comes at a cost. It increases everyone's water bills and also uses a lot of energy, which isn't good for our climate. Some of the chemicals we worry most about are actually the ones that persist in the environment. They don't break down um, for a very long time, potentially, and can cause long-term harm and damage to the environment. We've been doing a lot of work with partners such as Wessex Water on pharmaceuticals and uh, the levels in the river water in, in this area. These have a big impact on the wildlife in the water. They affect the behaviour of fish and other creatures and so that affects their survival. Please buy responsibly when it comes to household chemicals. Products on sale in the UK have undergone checks to make sure they are safe for people and the environment. But this depends on them being used correctly and disposed of correctly. This is where you can make a huge difference. Make sure you buy responsibly. That means buying reputable brands from responsible stores. The internet is a great marketplace but it has enabled illegal sales of products containing banned and restricted chemicals. Avoid using very old chemical products. They may contain substances that are now banned. Banned because they are harmful to your health and to the environment. Dispose of all unwanted chemicals responsibly, including the contaminated packaging. Check the labelling, which should tell you how to dispose of it. Most councils provide a chemical disposal point at your local household waste recycling centre. Always take unwanted medicines back to a pharmacy. Return veterinary medicines to your vet. Don't wash out medicine bottles in the sink. What goes around, comes around. Never pour or wash any chemicals down the drain. Small changes, big picture. <laughs>